The T3 instrument measures pKa values, log p values, solubility, dissolution, and these are properties that are required during the development of new drugs. And in two different areas of drug development, number one in drug discovery, where people have, they may be looking at lots of different structures to see which has the optimum properties, maybe which one's going to be best absorbed, which one's going to be excreted best. They have to test many structures at an early stage of drug development. And another group of people need to look at molecules. They've perhaps decided already this is the drug they want to bring to market, but they need to get the right formulation so that it dissolves at the right pH in the stomach, that it doesn't get precipitated out in the gut or excreted without being absorbed. A lot of chemistry goes on here. And who does this work? Well, it's pharmaceutical companies mainly who do this research. And it's done in many countries, UK, of course, and the United States, but also Germany, other European countries, India, Japan, China. And we also have quite a lot of customers in universities because some of the work is at the cutting edge of the science and universities can have a great role to play in trying to give people guidance into which way the research into new drugs should go.